is a lot. Number one. <laughs> <laughs> Some fears, relationship problems, financial problems, okay, other problems, but we're not going to speak about those, eh? Hey? <laughs> okay, all right. So let's ask the Lord to reveal it to us. All right. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we take authority over every unclean spirit in his life. I command you to get out of this body right now. In Jesus' name. Who are you in this body? Who are you in this body? Get out of this body right now. I command you right now. Get out of this body. Out of this body. Right now. You devil. Get out of this body right now, you spirit of lust. Get out of this body right now. Out, out, out of this body. You devil, get out right now. Right now in Jesus' name. Fire of God upon him in Jesus' name. You devil, get out. You unclean spirit, get out of this body right now. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. This is a manifestation. Okay. Out. Out. In Jesus' name. Out. So it seemed like other things went and some things stayed behind. Okay, that does happen. So now we're going to get that spiritual wife out. Okay. All right, just relax. Just focus directly upon Jesus. Devil, I bind you right now by the Spirit of God. In the name of Jesus, you spiritual wife, I command you out of this body right now. In the name of Jesus, out of this body right now. In Jesus' name. You spiritual wife, get out of this body right now. I break your power. I break your power. I break the power of this eating and dreams. I break the power of, of, of what you're doing in his life. He is not married in the spiritual world. In Jesus' name, you devil, get out. Out of him right now. Out of him. In Jesus' name. Speak up. Get out. That thing had no right to stay, eh? How are you feeling now? Light. Thank you, Jesus. Wow. Jesus, Lord. Amen. Yeah, the Lord is done marvelous. Last time I came here, I was very tormented by different spirits that were coming from the non-Christian religion. So the practice of laws and rituals, it ended up causing me to be in bondage. So when I came here, I didn't even know how to ask for the prayer. When the pastor asked me, like, what can I pray to you for? I didn't know anything. What to say but there's a lot of things. But then he started mentioning she started mentioning some of the spirits of blood, the spirit of and when he talk about the spirit of blood, that's why I started shaking. I don't know what happened, but <laughs> I didn't know what happened. I was trying to hold myself, control myself, but I couldn't control myself. <laughs> I ended up falling. When I was driving, trying to get up, I couldn't get up. I, I really don't know what happened. But from that day, I'm free now. 
Christ the Lord. Fears that I hear, and the Lord of fears will come and hear like what I've done, like an accident. But from that day, I'm afraid I'm not really alone. Oh, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Jesus. Wow. Yes. Oh, that's really wonderful, and that sorted out a lot of things in your life. Yeah, there's a difference. There's a difference. Praise the Lord. Let's just give a hand of praise.